Southwest Florida, welcome back to Lee Piz Live. Where am I? Yeah, you guess right. I'm back to my old stomping ground, the Community Fun Day. This is about my fourth year coming out here. It's on my calendar for 2020. This is um, July 2019. Yes. Mount Hermon Ministries, a redeeming influence community outreach organization, RICO, Rico. all coming together to make it a success again it's a huge success right now we estimate about 1200 people out here and we're at the early stages probably get up to about 2000 <laughs> one of the perks of, of hosting Lee Pitts live on Fox 4 it's an independent show I own the show I do whatever I want to do and so I get to meet all types of people and when I come out to events like this I get to talk to the, the lady who organized it she'll come Let's over and give me a moment I know you like to keep rolling, and you already looking around I like know, I be doing I, when I, I do functions. I'm supposed to be getting up already. <laughs> so we have the first lady, a pastor, Cheryl we, uh, Glover. Now, Cheryl. Yes, sir. You're a pastor as well. I want to make sure I say that because that's important to the whole big picture, yes, right? I am. You actually preach or yeah. uh, go, go ahead. Yeah, I do. I preach. I, I don't really like that title so much. Okay. Because it comes with so much responsibility. So I like moving under First Lady and then where I have to preach or, or show up for speaking engagements, I do. Right. And sometimes I'll call her Michelle by mistake. Oh, Lord. That's a long story. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> I'll leave that alone. Yes. Hey, here we are again. Yes. You know, when we first started doing this, it was an idea. It's just kept growing, kept growing, and now yeah. it's, just, it's just magnificent. Every year, it, it never it seems to disappoint. It keeps growing. Tell us some of the changes that have uh, been added on to this one compared to the previous years. Well, the changes that we've added certainly would be tied to a lot of the raffles that we gave out. We had parents who said, well, listen, we're out there too. We want to be able to win some raffles. So we brought some things in for them. The other thing that you'll see, we have the uh, uh, bookmobile that's here. We have um, the premier bus, the medical premier bus by uh, Nadine. She's that's out here. That's a full here. service medical bus full on service. the premise. Yes. And I've already hit Nadine for a quick comment. Not on air yet. She told me a lot of people are going to that bus. Go ahead. Yes, and we have the cooling station. So uh, we don't want people passing out. Last year we had a couple people that got overheated. So we've got a cooling station. Oh, really? Yeah. So there's the, the Fort Myers Department, uh, Fire Department has a cooling station where they've actually have fans and then they've got actual really? water that they're giving That's out. That's that red tin uh, over there. Yeah, the red tin over there. So they're able to go sit there and cool off a little bit. The other thing, too, is that we added, we have had the rappers last year but we only had them in sections this year they're all the entertainment all so types of entertainment all types of entertainment um and then what does the that mean oh it means some r&b too what? Yeah. As long as it's clean. As long as it's clean. That's what I like but about I, you guys. Y'all understand yeah, you how to reach everybody. Clean music is yeah, clean music. It's, we listen to it in our cars. <laughs> <laughs> we can't get on the we church listen. property and act like we don't listen to right. it. Right. Like if you go turn music, the baby. car on now, they've got some R and B going on good, in good. the car. I'm glad you expanded so, it to yeah, that. Yeah. That, 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 that again, taking in everybody community. Yeah. Right? This is community. That's why we're here. We want people from all over, all backs of their lives whatever whoever they are we welcome them here so uh, and the thing is you'll see that we have some uh, homeless population out here too right they are actually uh, with the Harry Chapin where they're actually giving out 30 bags uh, 30 pound bags of food um, so it's just it's a huge thing it's kind of hard to identify everything well, there's I want so you, much I want going to move on. You on to another <laughs> another spot being a okay. TV guy tell us what time it started today what happened early on and what phase we're in right now oh well this morning we actually had our health forum where we probably had about 300 plus inside and uh, we had dr sal from lee health he was here we had dr pedro that was here um and we we've actually had a full forum where they were talking about the health and wellness and and what is it that we need to do to keep, keep ourselves healthy um so once we did that we actually had more people coming here um at about 9 30 for the 11 o'clock event so they were still waiting for us to kick off at 11 o'clock so we just have a bun rush of everybody and i noticed when i pulled up the organized the parking is organized oh, yeah. oh, plenty yeah. of parking people we'll oh, be yeah. doing it again next year in july if you missed it this year uh the um talk about the volunteerism 
not oh only from your church, God. but from other people to make this This happen. is a community event, which means it's not just Mount Hermon. We're hosting it. You know, Rico is hosting it. But what we've done is we pulled in community partners because if it's a community event, it's just not going to be Mount Hermon Ministries that's out here doing all the volunteerism. We've got about 125 volunteers on campus right now. And uh, wow, what we do for our... 125. Yeah. Outstanding. Yeah. I, my cameraman is a volunteer. What's your name? All right, come over here and get See, your we, TV we, we right quick. We got our volunteers. They start Get right young. here look in the camera. Yeah. Get right here and bend so down. This so is our camera, young you volunteer. Our young volunteer. He's yes. running the camera. What's so your name? we've got Say young that. people that are here. All right. Yes. All right, go back to work, bro. Boy. Go ahead. So our volunteers aren't just old. We got them young. We train them up very young, and they come in, and they are here to be a redeeming influence in this community, and that's what this is all about. One of the things that happened about three years ago when I came, I got my blood pressure checked in there, uh -huh. found out I had high blood pressure, got myself into the clinic, got my blood pressure oh, pill. Yeah, day. right here at Mount Herman Ministries. Street nice. Health Forum, right. okay. thanks to uh, Diane, uh, Spears. Diane Spears and yes. all of them. Yes, and you yes. got some other success stories like that as well. I'm Absolutely, sure. and they maintain, they keep in touch with these people because what happens is for that to happen, they had to, uh, I, I guess, provide you a follow up protection or mm -hmm. if you didn't have one. So they do the follow up on that. We've got two tall clown over here. She came up early. Look at her. Um, but um, the other thing too. Pan over to that clown. The other, the you other. Can go that thing, way, yeah. And we, as you pan over there. We just, just, just stay right there. Stay right there so you can get you on the yes, shot. Yes, two town. Give pump, us a little pump, pump something. Two tall, two tall. Behind her is the Harry Chapman. Yes, Bank. go ahead, girl. Everything out here for the kids and the yes. adults. You the other thing that, that we did, we're doing differently, is we had stopped doing the screenings in the past by 1130. This time, it's screenings going on all day, so simultaneously, you, simultaneously, the adults can be out in the um, church getting the screenings. The kids are out here, bounce house, everything. So. You guys believe, and I talked to the pastor about this. You guys believe in uh, ministering to the community mm -hmm. physically with yes. good health yes. and spiritually. That's right. That Expound on that. Well, I um, I don't know how many people know, but I sit on the Southwest Board of uh, American Heart Association. Mm. And um, we have uh, now expanded that um, nutrition side of it where we actually have a, um, a, a chef that drives over from the East Coast. Every Wednesday, we host a six-week really? increment class. And we're going to be opening that up to the community the end of August. So you guys are going to see some information. If you are out there and you want to learn how to eat culturally relevant food, we teach you that here too. So you get natural food and the spiritual food. Outstanding. This is Community Fun Day 2019 yes. at Mount Hermon Ministries property. I'm Lee Piss of Lee Piss Live. We're the media sponsor. As long as I'm breathing and able and all these good things, I will be coming out here covering this. This is one of the highlights on my calendar every year. As you can tell, Cheryl and, and Pastor Glover, they're like family to me. And uh, we're going to keep on. This thing is going to get to the point, uh, sh uh, First Lady, that I don't know if this property is going to be able to hold it. What are we going to do then? We're going to open up. we got property all the way around the church. Okay. <laughs> I just got it all thought out. <laughs> we, we've already expanded it, putting the other tent back there. So we already started to add to more other uh, properties. What a blessing. Yeah, God is just awesome. But I do want to acknowledge yeah. you because you come out here. Listen, guys, I have to fuss at him <laughs> every year. Because he wants to sit directly in the sun, so we have to keep him hydrated. But he has entered into this um, this vision with us, redeeming the community, and I am just so appreciative of that. Thank I love you, you and I, I I know that we're gonna keep this partnership. So thank you, Big Bro. Hey, check this out. Check this out. When I come to work, I'm old school. <laughs> now <laughs> the reason I like to be in the sun is because. For technical reasons, all this beautiful sunlight that you see shining on her and on me, it brightens us up, giving us natural lighting, and it makes for a great community fun day. I got all my Gatorade and everything here, but she's always looking out for my health. Hey, hey, Cheryl, you only have to sit out here in this for one interview. I know. I'll do about 20 of them. And, <laughs> and see, to do that, that shows me love. Right. You so, love what you do. You love this event. You love the vision that we have, because nobody else is going to sit here directly in the sun and enjoy it. Let so, me, thank you. Let me share this. When I started this show off over 25 years ago, it was a grassroots effort. I did it by myself. I brought it up and made it what it is today. 
at that time, I had to get down and dirty and go out and build a brand for this television show. So I never lost that grind that it takes to build something. No more than you guys have not lost that grind that it takes to keep on building and maintaining Mount Herman Ministries. All right. Hands on. Hands on. Thank you. We'll be right back.